Can you just tell me a little bit about yourselves? Uh, hi, my name is Carl. Um, I'm a uh, paramedic here with uh, New South Wales Ambulance based on the Central Coast. Um, I have been in that, uh, that employ now for oh, coming up for 20 years. Um, Grace? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, my name is Grace. I'm care service employee. I work in aged care and I've been on Dutch for four years now. Four years, is it? Yeah, something like that, yeah. yeah. Yep. Time, time's passed. Yeah, mm. I came from the Philippines and that's it. <laughs> <laughs> and you're a good cook? A little bit. <laughs> I haven't actually owned any properties at all. Um, and I was just, you know, not sure what I was doing and don't know where to look and what to do. So I was very lost, but um, at the same time, you're getting a lot of, um, lots of different opinions and lots of different views from lots of different people. So uh, it was just very, uh, it was just too much to, to take on. Um, and then about three years ago, I bought my own property um, in Sydney where I'm living in at the moment, and it was off the plan. And so, uh, which um, you know, just throughout that time, I uh, encountered a lot of problems as well because it was off the plan, and um, and I bought it on, on my own. So there was nobody to help me, and um, there were a lot of issues. So, but I'm been living in it now. So yeah, I've been living in it for two years now. So between us, we've got three businesses. Um, my main business is I'm an electrician. I'm my own company, um, which keeps me extremely busy. Uh, we've also just started, we just built a uh, custom built camper van which was started hiring out. And then um, I've also, I'll let her explain what she does. Yeah, so I, I work part time and uh, four days a week. And then the other Friday, Saturday, I work on my own business uh, doing website builds and design and branding. Um, so I'm working hard on building that up till eventually I can let go of my part-time work, um, but the camper van business keeps me busy as well, so there's plenty happening. Uh, well, I'm 59, um, 31 again, 30 again, 30 again, where have you said? I work as a, I work as a um, uh, workplace health and safety manager with Vodafone, or now called TPG. Um, I've had investment properties before, and and uh, I just went through a divorce, I'm a single dad, so uh, with a teenage, had a teenage girl with me for a while, he went off the rails a bit. So um, I, the delay was because I had to change jobs. She went through mental health classes, as you know, and I came back to Newcastle, so I left a really good job in Sydney to be there to support her. Um, in that period of 12 months, I had like six jobs in 12 months, it's horrendous, and finally settled where she got sorted, went back to Sydney and back to my career, which is where I am now, hence why there was a two year delay, I think it was, Jackie. We've been together for about six years now. Um, both previously married, so we had um, houses, houses and, yeah, and, 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 and been yep. through all the rigmarole of divorce, um, and and then we ended up, you know, getting a, a nice new mortgage, <laughs> which was something I wasn't really looking forward to after paying the house off. Yeah, so back into that again, um, but you know, you have so to do these do. things. Oh, yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. Get back on the horse, yeah? Yeah. It's, um, actually, it's very powerful what you're mentioning. I've been divorced myself and it is sad when, you, and I'm sure you've got friends that went through a divorce and never actually got even just buying principal place of residence ever again. Yeah, yeah that's so, true. Um, I've yeah, just gone rent and, and, and go down that path. Yeah, absolutely. So um, that's fantastic, and, and obviously, I mean, I'm very proud of you. You've actually started um, the wealth, a wealth creation journey. Um, Darren and this is my wife Kirsty. Um, we live in Sydney and we got in, interested in property investment, trying to secure our, our future and our retirement. Um, hopefully we can stay healthy and have enough money at the end of it to uh, retire and have fun. Yeah, well you're looking very good you two. I haven't seen you for a while, so you're, you're looking good. We've got three children. Uh, we've also got two grandchildren and we've been working for a very long time trying to to you know build a life and, and a lifestyle that, that we both enjoy. Um, and so we've gotten to a bit of an age now where you know we, we want to start thinking about our future 
and and how we can help our our children also to start off in their life in in the right foot on the right foot